actually shoot their quills and what are they made out of that? Well, questions like that wind up in my Google search. Thankfully, Sean Putney from the Kansas City Zoo is here with the answers and the beautiful Jasiri. So this girl, oh my goodness, one of my favorite things, I matched her today. You see the, it's, it's not very nice. You see the business <laughs> end. We don't have her facing the camera right now. This is her debut, just so everybody knows. So Ooh. she's a little camera shy. We brought her out last week just so uh -huh. she'd get used to the studio. However, there's a lot of people around now, so well, this uh, is she's just getting used to it. We gave her ear a corn, so she's very comfortable now, but uh, facing the wrong way. It's okay. She is killing the corn. <laughs> I mean, who wouldn't, though? You put corn in, com in front of yeah, her, she's right. going to sit right down and just let everybody take in her majesty. This is a great experience for her, just yeah. a another step in in um, until she graduates. Uh, so she's oh. been getting used to being around people. She's gonna be a part of our, our shows program. So she's oh. been on stage, getting used to that. Uh, we have a mixed species animal program that, mm -hmm. at the zoo on two at 2.30 each day. Ooh. So, she's oops, sorry. Ooh. Hey, she really Whoa. saw the business sense. So I'm sorry. Note to self, try not yeah, to get it. Sorry, it's my future. fault, it's my fault. Okay, let's talk about those spikes, right? They just flared up. You know, what are they? And, or Maybe so not even though spikes, I didn't mean we'll to do that, quills. yeah, quills. Yeah. So, so even though I didn't mean to do that, that shows everybody exactly what they do for defense. So, okay. let, let's say there's a big cat that's trying to chase them down. Okay. They can actually push push those up, face their predator, so they'll back towards them. So the predator might think, I don't want to have anything to do with that. Um, so they, they live in Africa, lots of big mm -hmm. predators over there, but you can see they, they've survived over time because of their defensive mechanisms. Oh my gosh, and talking about the defense, can they run backwards? Uh, they can, I wouldn't say run, but okay. they can definitely wiggle quickly. Wiggle, yeah. Yes, okay. yes, and you talked about the quills and, and shooting them out. Mm -hmm. That's really a cartoon type of thing. Oh that really gosh. doesn't happen. However, they can become dislodged, so if something was trying to attack them and mm -hmm. they were pushing into them, those quills can easily get stuck into the nose of a lion. Lion, say and wow and then it dislodges from them and then that that lion it's kind of a lesson learned for them hey I don't really want to mess with the porcupine again not worth it yeah so let's talk about these where did they live and we see corn on the cob and I think those are carrots what what do they eat sweet potatoes, sweet potatoes. love sweet potatoes oh. loves corn as you can see so we brought all mm -hmm. of her her good treats okay. uh, so we want to make it a good experience although yeah. I spooked her on the first toss uh, we want to make this as good an experience as possible so that she'll want to come back and see you again. Oh and my as gosh. far as where do they live, Bring these, her anytime. Th these guys are from Africa. Um, they go as far north as Italy, actually, so okay. not just Africa, but there are over 20 species of mm -hmm. porcupines from around the world. We have some here in North America. You don't see them a lot because they're more nocturnal, even though she's out right now yes. uh, and she's kind of adapting to day life. Normally, they're nocturnal animals. Oh, such a wonderful animal. But real quick, we do have some events coming up in April at the zoo. Lots you of events. You talked about the live show. Uh, yes. Mm -hmm. So these guys, are, or she's going to be a part of the show. We increase our shows in the summertime. Mm -hmm. if, if you haven't seen them before, we have two bird shows during the day. We have a, a uh, animal show that we have a mixed species in there that's in the afternoons at 2.30. This weekend we have Daniel Tiger that's coming out, so back by popular demand. Mm -hmm. uh, that's Saturday and Sunday from 10 to 2. Then we have, we're celebrating uh, Earth, Earth Day yeah. uh, the following week. So and it's April, so we're celebrating the apes as well. April, yes. that's we right. That. So that's this weekend. <laughs> and then at the end of the month we have Marvel characters coming out, so that's wow. always fun. Superhero weekend, always a good time. And you can always see this baby girl. She'll probably be enjoying some corn. And if you, you can't know, see her, her brothers are on exhibit. Oh, yes. We have some relatives that are on exhibit in our tropics building. So come see them. Well, thank you so much, Sean. And of course, just Siri.